Good morning. I'm using the Suckless desktop, DWM, D menu, my little tools, and I wanted to just show you how easy and, and how good it is, really. So I'm using DWM right now. That means it's a tiling uh, window manager. So when I open up a new window or a new browser window, it's tiled. It don't, they don't overlap, which is great to work with. And another great thing about the Suckless sort of experience is when you have D menu installed, you have like, well, the spot like a spotlight functionality in, in Mac OS X. I'm not too sure what it's called in Windows. Um, but unlike Spotlight and whatever it is in Windows, it's very, very fast. So I press Alt P, and you can see on that top bar, I have a list of all the binaries that it picks up in my path. And I can just type G I M, and then I quickly get like. A, GIMP is one binary, so basically order completes when I type. And the great thing is I can load in, into my path my own tools that I can just execute very quickly using this um, using this paradigm. Uh, one thing I use a lot is I have a, a tool called Screenshot, and it's just what well, four lines here. It calls Scrot, and it calls um, I think I use a patch Scrot. Um, and then once it's taken the screenshot it calls upload and upload is another little shell script and what does it do it takes the file name it compresses it so it's even smaller with PG, uh, P, PNG quant and, and it puts it in this sort of date structure and then it copies it to my clipboard so let me just give you a demonstration alt p screenshot and now that should be in my clipboard and let me go back to my browser open up a new tab copy see that's how simple it is you know there's none of this sort of horrible dropbox frame or whatever the clippy or whatever the these horrible um, screenshot sharing sites do this is uploaded to s3 it's super duper fast and I even take the time to compress the image and you know that that you can see from that URL, it's my domain. You can see that it's taken on a certain date. Um, oops. And um, it's actually got a kind of an unguessable URL, which is good, because uh, sometimes I post sort of sensitive um, screenshots that I don't want other people to see. So it's it's an excellent sort of URL for sharing what you're looking at, and that is so so important when it comes to debugging and showing where problems are. So I really hope this um, sort of shows you how to use Suckless uh, to get the job done in a very, very simple and effective way.